we are back and we have the last hour block for this for today's stream everyone is being put to sleep go to sleep go to sleep So much of this needs to be like reworked out somehow. Now we lost our bookkeeper, right? No, we didn't. I just never assigned him an office. Who is this? Dragoman. Oh, we, well, we got lucky that he happens to have one anyways. Dragoman the bookkeeper. Keep those books. Give me some type of precision. How much booze would a booze hound booze if a booze hound could booze hound? Makes sense. Think about it. Um, wood furnace. Make two charcoal. Can't. We don't have wood. Why are my woodcutters? Not cutting down the wood. Because they're still listening to story. In the late winter of the year 210, Cryptonim became a militia captain in a citadel of plunging. Why do we not leave this place? All right, new idea. And they don't have priorities assigned to them. That's weird. That'd be why. I guess that was a glitch command. I don't know what that is. I'm guessing that now they will. I am apparently guessing wrong. I have two tree haters who... Where are the axes? Where are the axes? What is wrong with the axes? They're not forbidden. I, th I was suspecting they were forbidden or lost somewhere. Now one of them started to be the one that tells the story. What the shit? All right, new idea. Whatever is happening here, this stockpile doesn't exist anymore. It's gone. It's a non-stockpile. Now they're watching someone dance. The dance has reached the point where its accompaniment is at a simple passage. The sheet. Oh my god, this is long. The ghost staying rhythm is a single line with four beats. The beat is stressed as follows XX dash dash, where the X is a beat and the dash is silent. So it goes. Monday, Tuesday, happy day. No. Um, okay, cool. Stop dancing and fucking get the axe. You sons of bitches. Recreate a weapon stockpile so someone grabs the axe, drags it over. If someone can drag the axe, that means the axe is in fact grabbable. It looks like they're bringing over all the weapons, so I'm gonna say the axe is grabbable and you're an asshat. to me like they moved that axe no so what about that axe though they move the axe grab the fucking axe what do tree haters do am i wrong about my own skills tree haters wood cutter why are you not cutting the wood
Are they claimed by the military? I'm purging the military. Is the axe for free now? Copper battle axe task. Somehow the military had claimed dibs on the axe, so they weren't allowed to grab it. I don't understand why they weren't active duty. They weren't holding it, but somehow because it was in the equipment portfolio, I'm guessing a script was done or an update was done to Door Fortress to try to make it easier for the military to use equipment, perhaps? So because they had a check marked as a military axe, it was not usable for civilians. And now there is a dwarven child complaining about how life sucks and nothing is in fact right in the world. Yeah, look, now they're both cutting down the trees. It was because the military claimed them. When I recruited everyone into the military, when we were attacked by the goblins, some of the people in the military must have claimed dibs on the ax. Don't know if they ever used it, but because they claimed dibs, somehow you could move the ax around, but you could not do a direct use of it. Also, where's all the blue grass? Whip vines. Okay. Now, why are these people not getting buried? It's definitely saying, have we filled up all of these? Holy shit, we filled them all up. How many more do I got? 18. All right, let's get some more people buried. I am, however, gonna tell him to stop that on repeat. I think after the 18, we'll just hit enough, we'll be fine. But now the carpenter can finally make the damn cage so it can stop bitching to me about the fucking cage that I don't care about. You know what? Decorate with shell. I don't even know if I have a shell crafter, but decorate with shell just because I'm tired of sealing those shells. And all these things that clearly never got used, dump the horse, dump the cow, Dump the other horse. Dump the rotten ankovies. The rotten souls. The Nautilus. Yeah, dump all those. I don't want to see them anymore. Dump the horse. of things now for burials should grab the last of the dwarves and body parts up here and anything else I should at that point be free to dump but I suspect what we have left is dwarves and or dwarven body parts they grabbed them all so they must have been dwarves not to worry about that anymore fantastic because I don't anticipate dumping anything else in the near future pull the lever pull the lever cronk Pull the damn lever, Kronk. Wrong lever. Why is the bridge covered in blood now? How like the cow blood spurted up as it got crushed? Ew. Could you imagine lowering the, the drawbridge and just like a fountain of blood shoots up from it? Yeah, because that's the blood from below. <laughs> oh, that would have to be awful. Yep. <laughs> oh, 
Um, doodly 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 day. I'm gonna take off the bottom of this because build construction wall. We're gonna say for autumn to be here. For autumn is upon us, and it is time for the leaves to fall. That's why in America we shall call it fall. Because it is a time the leaves fall down. And in spring, it is a time the leaves spring up. And in summer, it's when we all bake to death because it's fucking hot. Ooh. All right, so for any of you who were holding out, I would point out to you. I mean, we, we've we been getting migration wave after migration wave. So we now have a net surplus of people without a nickname. We don't appear to be immediately dying anymore. So if you weren't dwarfing earlier because you were scared, I mean, I, I definitely feel for you. <laughs> you probably had a good point there, I'm not gonna lie, but if you are wanting to get dwarf within this stream, we are in the last hour of the stream. You still have about an hour, don't get me wrong, but you only have till the next hour break to get dwarfed if you wish to be dwarfed before next Saturday's Dwarf Fortress stream. I'm wanting to create a thing to like force them to have to go over the traps if they want into the base. Problem is, I'm kind of in my own way. Can we get statues in? No. <laughs> That'll probably come into play next stream, but I'm not going to finally having a moment of respite, respite in this uh, base. Spend it trying to come up with your convoluted statue designs. Especially because half the time you guys don't even know that how the statue designs work. Humph. <laughs> If I give you more time to plot, maybe, perhaps, you'll know what works, what can actually be designed in a statue instead of asking for fucking insane things. I would like... I would like Mayor Machise from McDonald's to be riding astride Barney except Barney's shooting lasers out of his eyes and Mayor McCheese on his Barney mount is slaughtering the elves and the elves are in fact jovially cheering for their own demise. Is that your plan? Is that what your statue was? How close was I? <laughs> Sounds cool. <laughs> That reminds me of the anime. What was it called? There was one that never got to fruition. I wonder why. From a couple years ago. To call it anime is a stretch. I mean, it's an anime. But what was going on was weird. I mentioned it a few times. They had like four episodes. And what they did is there was an anime about... Sega and then... Nintendo fighting each other, but they try to reimagine him as like half samurai warriors, but with magic. So Mario was this big beefy rip dude who literally rode around on a vol on a fucking T-Rex Velociraptor. And like the scene they introduce him, he literally has the Velociraptor jump off the cliff and then he jumps from the Velociraptor to elbow drop the enemy's fucking warship and it explodes or some nonsense. 
they only went for like three episodes <laughs> three or four the main character was essentially sonic i'm forgetting what his name was but he, he was blue his his friend's name was tilu his friend's name his friend's name was tilu and was orange and he died at the beginning so sonic realized that he just had to keep struggling to fight in life and he developed the power to just keep moving forward and as long as he kept moving forward he would get stronger <laughs> but it but it was the um the segawa the segawa something versus the nintendo empire they were fighting over the remains because the atarica republic had collapsed so <laughs> it was fucking weird so a statue of a hamburger man atop a dinosaur and 500 elves the hamburger man is slaughtering the elves the elves are cheering why would you even try to see if you could translate that to an actual statue? Why is that the thing you come up with? Where are all these monsters from now? Are these the merchants? No, we're surrounded by porcupine men now. Why are there porcupine men and women here? Go away. I've already had combat for today. I don't think I want to deal with you and your horrible spines of justice. All right, we're no longer decorating with shell. We are making shell crafts. I don't even know what I've been decorating with shell. What has he been doing? I de I've been decorating arrows. Arrows coated into Chulu's blood with Nautilus shells. Good job. We're gonna resell them. Used arrow, hardly used. Been straight to the artery. No damage, near mint condition. <laughs> what the shit? Stop. Um, I'm not even sure what I can trade you or what I want to trade you. Let's get you the arrows since I do bolts and apparently we're decorating them. So maybe we have some of these that are worth a little bit more. Let's trade the arrows. And then, let's trade some shells. You do not have a broker. You should get a broker. Well, it looks like this dwarf right here is the best broker I've ever seen. Wait, so am I dead? I mean, maybe. There's an arrow with your blood on it. I don't, I don't know. I'm just making a joke about how everyone, whenever you see these used things like, oh, it's refurbished. It's good as new. You fucking boot up and goes, Neeh! and it just catches fire. I don't trust those. I don't trust them when they're like refurbished, good as new. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know what I want from you because I, don't know how I'm gonna live. Take those off of there. Have the goods been moved? They have. All five of them. But oh fuck, what was that alert? What did you just bitch about? Who's hungry? What? Is it animal related? It's probably animal related. You gotta bet it's that baby llama. I'm a baby llama, short and stout. Dead people for important. Um, what can I get in here out of the way? Put the duck, the guinea hen, the blue pea hen, and the duckling just to get them out of the way. That leaves one cat and two dogs I don't really care about right now. We probably should. We do have an artifact bone spear. So maybe we can get bones to turn into bolts so our hunters do things. However, comma, we are also at the brink of everyone stabilizing and I don't want to risk that our guys are incompetent, run into melee and somehow die to the enemy porcupine people's quills and get themselves killed. So right now, we're just going to pretend that we're at peace with the porcupines and maybe in a few months, we reveal to them that we're in fact the Fire Nation and we're going to attack.
I know I'm putting the grave back. We know it's not going to work. Um... What was I doing? I think I built a wood furnace to make charcoal. I did that so I can have another furnace to be the glass furnace. So we can have a glass furnace to make the window. <laughs> this is asinine. Now this got set up, which means I'm gonna start this pump manually now. So I, if I can get the water in there to be at least threes, I'm not wanting to fill it up because I'm gonna wanna experiment with that later. And if it's filled up, it's gonna make the other room a pain to deal with because the one on the right has more volume. But it does generate power and it fills up immediately. Stop pumping. There we go. So now if something happens, we have fresh water. Why did you zoom me down here? It, it hasn't been abandoned. I'm building it now, you lazy bastards. So now what? If I build it, they'll be like, oh, well, you didn't agree to it anyways. So there's no point in doing it. We have a survivalist, right? Did that get butchered? It's an echidna corpse, but I don't see it being butchered. Do we not have a butcher? We have a butcher. It says task, but I don't see it saying butcher. Butcher and animal. Now it's active. Weird. Banana. Where are we getting this ammo from to make them fire? They weren't doing it earlier. Trade. I want to give you all of these. Whatever we have. And it's worth 279. We're rolling in it. Um. Okay. Okay. Come on, your turkey. to eat eggs. We are in yet another area that fucking freezes. I get one turkey. We've grabbed the one turkey and in the future, we'll grab it by its horns. And we'll use the turkey. Uh, I don't want any of your barrels, technically. I would take a bunch of your clothing, but I feel like they'd be slightly annoying right now. I don't want to go through that. Particularly because I know I'm not going to be allowed to do the trades. So what I will instead do is I will trade for your leather bins and your cloth bins. Oh, I didn't see the massive loss racking. I was look. There you go. There you go. Everyone's happy. Capitalism has succeeded this day. All right, let me think. We still have people without beds. Those are negative thoughts. So let's just cram out a few extra beds and throw it in a corner somewhere. So we don't have to worry about them, at least for right now, in their pursuit of mediocre beds. We were working on getting this so we'd have power and so we could have water. This system appears to be mostly kind of working. Someone's having a tantrum again. Fantastic. I was just saying to myself, please, please let them have a tantrum again. If I build a gear assembly on this side, I can go back to building the water wheels. This system appears to work and my idea is that I get these top row and the bottom row via the system on the right to connect to the middle row, which means it all has the same power that I can transfer on the other side of the middle row. 
That way I can keep this out of the way of the water being swished around when the system is fully operational. Because there's going to be lots of swishing. Build machine. Water wheel. All I need for this is wood. I think I have plenty of wood. So this sh should not be too difficult. Build machine. While I'm at it, I want a horizontal wheel going north and south. That is too large. We've already done the thing on the left, so there's no reason to not be able to do this one. Cancels harvest plants too depressed. Poor buddy. He's so sad. Now, when I dumped that water in, it went here and it was immediately finding a way to splash up over there. Because of course it was. Which tells me I probably should have stuck to my original idea of making it curve a little bit left to prevent the water from doing such a thing. Probably should have just stuck to my guns when I first came up with that idea. New problem, though, is there's going to be a wall there. There is already a wall in the downside, so I have to redesign the wall down here. Good. Second thing, just to see, what happens if I pump over here? Now, I know a bunch of it's going to go backwards because I don't have the thing to stop it. I don't have a wall or anything over there. But... How effectively... Oh, that one dude. Why are you over there? He's confused. Did he fall down this side? It is pretty effective. Now, if I bleed water out of the system... So that's kind of part of the whole purpose of this, is I want to bring water in, but also bring water out. Like, I need to use the same water to generate power. I need to pump the water in at the same rate I'm pumping water out. Or, actually, probably even a little less. Well, no, it depends. I'm trying to get the cycle, so maybe not a little less, but... Or just have that be as a separate pump cycle. My hope is that if I bring it down to the twos and ones, it evaporates. Looks like this is working. All right, you can probably stop pumping. Believe this has worked fantastically. Now that I can get back down there, I have to carefully consider how I'm going to do this ramp. If I build the wall here first, which I'm going to have to, I believe, I build the wall there first, the ramp can work off the top, which allows me to fix the left, then build a ramp to the left, allowing me to correct the ramp to the north. All of this so I don't have to do is stairs. Over here on the left, that's going to need to be dug out, but that's been completed. So, build machine gear assembly. I'm going to need some more mechanisms. Namely, one, two, minimum, so we'll do four. At some point, these will get moved down to where it makes way more sense for them to be. Must remove this one by one.
for now because that pumped out a lot of water why don't i just build walls across do i i don't need that many screw pumps screw pumps are quite effective at moving water i just build walls all the way across for the rest of it that should secure that for now and if it turns out later i need more pumping action i could always just get more i think it'd be far cheaper in the long run just to do this And while they are getting the floor out of the way, I don't see any reason why I can't start ordering the wheels. A hunter has grown attached to a steel crossbow. Where do we get a steel crossbow from? Where do we get a steel? Where did you... He had to have come in with it, right? The only thing I can think of is he came into the map with a steel crossbow. What do you mean you could not find path? You what? What? Why did you cancel? Why did you fucking cancel? Do the wheel. Maybe I could have understood if that was like the middle wheel. Because I had ordered that to be done when there was a path next to that area, but the first wheel on the left was never had, never had anything touching it. So why did that get... What the hell are you guys doing? Why? Whatever, we'll get rid of the entire floor first. I don't understand what's going on with these wheels. Oh, good. The Mason is having a fight in the middle of the dining room. Huzzah. Maybe the goblins had it, maybe that was it, which makes it ours now. True, perhaps the goblins had steel crossbows and somehow in our fight, we got lucky enough to steal it from them. These are in fact possibilities. And if they happened, then we, we know who to praise that's right, Rash. We must, in fact, praise Rash. Don't forget the laser eyes. I don't know why I didn't see that till now. Yes, do not forget the laser eyes. Hold on. What is going on to the wheels up top? What the hell happened to these wheels? Weren't they always there? Am I? Were, were they or were they not just always there? Oh my God, they're trying to design it off the wood in the back. That's why they're going crazy. They're trying to use the wood up there. Look, chestnut log, chestnut log, chestnut log. When it wasn't forbidden, it said I can only use two. For some reason, they thought the wood in the back was clearly the wood that would need to be used for these wheels. Because of course, that just makes perfect sense. Also, have we made the gear assembly yet? Good. Cancels give water. What are you horrified by? And of course it freezes. It freezes when I've got the no water. I didn't think that through. So now whoever's injured can't be given water. Because I just got rid of it all. I am the smartest one you'll ever see. Look at me. Me so smart. Build horizontal axle north south. Well, at the very least, we're having a period of calm collection so I can get this project done. How well it's going to work is a different, different story entirely. But at least we have this. I can start removing these now. 
because this has been built. Button. He removed the left wall so I could channel that down. And I would need to dig this out. Put a wall there, build a ramp there. Build, destruction, ramp. Should we get a drawbridge so we can turtle before the next siege comes? No, I feel like these five cage traps done one wide is completely fine. This will stop any any invasion coming our way whatsoever. 100% faith in that cage trap line. <laughs> Remember, we can't turtle. If we turtle, we're not playing it correctly. You guys specifically said you wanted me to turtle less, so no turtles. We are going to sit here like lizards on our back with our junk flapping around because that proves we're not turtles. On serious things though, it require a an investment of cages and mechanisms that I'm slightly using right now. I can get the mechanisms going. I don't think I need a mechanic for the wheels, but the carpenters are kind of half being used by the wheels I'm doing right now. Once these are done, I can order up more cage traps. And as long as they don't come in a massive number, they could just slowly walk through them and we can catch like eight, nine of them. That'll, that'll stop the entire invasion. We start turtling now, it's FPS death six months from now. Let's say 100 glass spikes. Winter has arrived. Ah ha ha, now it's winter. Feels so cold. Good. Because I'm slightly more worried about the amount of damage I'm going to cause the doors when I get this system working. The pump should be on opposite sides. I've done this entire thing wrong. The water is going to be coming in from the lower left when it's cycling correctly, which means you want a proper flow instead of just a short one. You want it to go diagonally across the room. That is where the pumps need to be. I would pump more in, but it's frozen and I'm a moron. <laughs> no construction wall. Peachwood log, willow log. That would be the new thing. I could remove this ramp and that wall. I can't do it. I just can't. Yes, yes you can. Why? Holy shit, why? It was not a complicated thing. Just build the damn water wheel. Build machine screw pump from the south. I'm thinking two should be enough. I'm gonna unforbid these wood logs now, so maybe I can use them and get them out of the way. Water wheel. There we go. I think that was all the ones that had a small distance. Why is someone down there? Did get go down there to get water? I just saw a dwarf go running down there. There's nothing down there. Whatever. Clearly there's something I, I'm not aware of. Just let him do whatever he wants to do. 
Of course he's throwing a tantrum. What do you want me to do with the child throwing a tantrum? You want me to kill him? I'll kill the child. I mean, that's kind of messed up. I don't know why you're asking me to kill a child for you, but I mean, if that's what this is coming to, I mean, that's just the way the life is, I guess. Except an undead grinder would say 100 glass spikes. No, what's going, I mean, yes, you're mostly right. And by mostly, I mean, yes. What we're going to do is, this isn't part of the trade depot system at all. We're gonna take this, we're gonna fill this, we're probably going to take this, go out one, turn it into a maze. We're gonna path, we're gonna mate, we're gonna maze them like we're doing a mall. Does anyone here know what I'm talking about when I say mall? Please tell me, please tell me you guys know what the term mall is. M-A-U-L, like winter mall. We're going to maze them like a mall above ground. Can a drowning pick kill undead? No, it cannot. They do not breathe. Now, if we put them in a drowning pit and involve this out here and kill them, yes, yes, it could. Darth Maul, check. No! That was one of the few game modes that I re like, not few, but I mean, let me restate my whole premise. Uh... Warcraft 3 had a bunch of modded games, custom games, and they turned into things like League of Legends and shit. I never liked those game modes. I liked the game modes like Winter Mall and Element Mall. They were tower defense games, but eight player co-ops. They were eight player co-op tower defense games. And those never got turned into games. I don't know why, those things were amazing. Except for when you always inevitably die due to Gray because he didn't, you know, build enough turrets and he didn't have enough turrets because Yellow didn't leak enough at the beginning to give him money. And everyone knows if you're playing Yellow, you leak a little bit so Gray can get money. Everyone knows this. If you don't know this, you're in fact a noob. <laughs> I like adventure. I like them too. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying I only liked Winter Mall maps. I really love those. One of my favorite ones was the Warcraft 3 map that was Final Fantasy Tactics. They they programmed Final Fantasy Tactics into a Warcraft 3 map. And it was amazing. And that is why Blizzard's a moron for changing her things to nerf the fuck out of the old Warcraft 3. Thanks, Blizzard. Way to fuck that up. So now any version I get, if I want to play any of those now, is what? 100% guaranteed that if I want to have fun with the game, I have to torrent it? Why would a company do this? I do not know. Oh yes, if you buy the game through us, we'll, we'll nerf it for you. <laughs> we'll remove all the functionality and make it fucking impossible to play. <laughs> Thank you. Why would I do that? You know how many times I like repurchase Warcraft 3 from like Walmart and shit throughout the years? And then fucking now it's like, oh, we've got the Blizzard launcher. Well, that's great. Mayhaps I'd actually trust it and use it. Look, we're going to give you a new Warcraft 3 too. That looks pretty. Okay. Wait, we lied. We took out all the pretty. Oh no. Why did you do that? Also, we, ru we, we ruined your, uh, your, your regular Warcraft 3. Why? Why? Why would you do this? I genuinely don't know. Like, like I get the some ideas of things that maybe, but like the whole thing they did doesn't make sense. It's just asinine. Of course they did that one before they did the corner one. Why wouldn't they? Can we have Warcraft 3? No, we have Warcraft 3 at home. Warcraft 3 at home. Like, that genuinely baffles me. I don't, I, I, trying to think right now, I do not think I've ever heard of any game company going back 20 years after the fact, plus years after they first release a game and deciding, no, you've had too much fun with this. I'm going to actively, I'm going to proactively go out of my way to ruin the game you already have had and enjoyed for all these years. It's fucking asinine.
which like really makes it weird because quite genuinely it's not even like the argument could be said i don't think anyone would argue against the fact you can't play warcraft 3 anymore like they have warcraft 3 but it's no longer warcraft 3 so if you want to play warcraft 3 you have to torrent it like you have to if you want to if, if you want to have any bit of nostalgia and play any of the games from yesteryear if you want to do any of those custom maps or anything you have to go torrent the game you have to very specifically which is kind of weird because not, not like an actual legal argument i like i'm well aware that there, there's no such thing as a legal argument for him about to say but you know take this as like a magic the gathering D, D type argument let's let's argue the state-based effects of it if the current warcraft 3 not even like the new revised edition but the current original warcraft 3 is in such a state that it can't do the old maps it can't anymore but the old maps were warcraft 3 maps they're designed to work for warcraft 3 the new version doesn't do them is it warcraft 3 anymore like this isn't even a ship of theseus thing because it's like a, it's it, it's it's like it's a different design it doesn't do what the old ship does it's like trying to do an argument of ship of theseus but the new ship of theseus is a, is a fucking car like so it doesn't do the games it doesn't work the same they took out all the functionality for okay. multiplayer and all the good jazz okay. so it's not the same so you have to torrent it are you are you in fact downloading their game anymore like they've willingly sworn off their own game it's like a half weird version of abandonware at this point the warcraft 3 that had land and could do the the proper custom maps is now essentially abandonware but it is copyrighted abandonware that hasn't been abandoned except for all the ways it's been abandoned <laughs> Don't forget Steam with Grand Theft Auto San Andreas. They removed, moved, they removed the music from the game even if you owned it before the license expired. So if I understood that one, I, I'm i not siding with them here. That is kind of weird to go ahead and do that. But I think they were forced to, weren't they? Like that doesn't make any sense, but it wasn't them that did it. Wasn't it that the actual music companies came after them so they had to? Don't get me wrong. It's still the same idea as Warcraft 3. So, like, now if you want the original game, essentially the idea of the game that you used to have is Abandonware. But I, at least I don't think it's there. They don't, I don't think they take the blame for that one. So I think they were forced to, weren't they? Maybe I'm wrong on that one. It's still weird. Are we out of drank? <laughs> they change this. Yes, yes, we are out of drank. The problem is, is I ran the drank through. I, I ran the system through to clear it so I could do the walls right at the time of the year when all the water freezes. <laughs> I literally did it at the exact wrong time so all the water froze and just doesn't exist here anymore. So we, we have the no drank because I got rid of the drank. Oh yeah, no, I heard about this. Yeah, when they changed the Star Wars Galaxies games from a 30 to 50 class game where you could mix and match how you wanted to nine. Water Buffalo Calf is starving. I knew there was gonna be one. Yeah, I heard they got in trouble too. Um, everyone is quitting Star Wars Galaxies because it became public that they were working with the hackers. Like they were working with the cheaters. In addition to everything else. So they changed the game to get people to pay more money. But then on the side, we're also working with the people hacking and cheating at the game. Which is like, as far as I'm aware, a big no-no? You're not allowed to do that. <laughs> oh shit, you're right, we're out of drank drank. What the shit? 
good eye. Why are we out of... We had hundreds last time I checked. Now we have a mood. Oh, everyone is thirsty. I should have been paying attention. Yeah. Yeah, that's bad. Where is our brewmaster? He's brewing drink from plant right now. Shit. I don't know how I didn't notice that. What the fuck? I have two necromancers and a pale butcher. He's so pale. No, our base isn't going to go down like your base. Our base is going to stand strong and valiantly. Hey, picture point. How you doing? Where's this dude going with this mood? Oh good, he claimed it and then isn't doing anything. Bone logs. Needs metal bars. Why do you think I have metal bars? I don't have metal bars. Do I have metal bars? This is opal cluster, regular stone, niece, 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 niece. All I have is niece. Native gold, we're right above it. Okay. Let's try to get this man some gold before he goes crazy and kills himself. It'll be fine. Oh, I can't up that wall yet. Fuck. I see someone has decided to join the dying dwarves. Would you two like to die today? Picture point claiming dwarf number 15. All right, picture point. We'll get you in. We'll get you in. Don't you worry. I'll get you in as the single most starving dwarf I can. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Picture point. You are currently a mason you build the things that need to be built so that the rest of us may enjoy its stony goodness we're all going to die like unless the water thaws right now i have a sneaking suspicion we're all going to die after all that thirsty uh, i mean we are making booze all right picture point Picture point, you have no friends. You have no family. You have only passing acquaintances with everyone in the base. You pray to the Didi Mamgaz, who most often takes the form of a female dwarf and associated with war and fortresses. Pic pic picture point, yeah, it hasn't gone all the way through yet. Picture point recently thought there's nothing like a good brawl because in the last season he was interested after watching a performance. Picture point is almost never sick and tough, but he is slow to heal. Picture point likes alanite, copper, melanite, giant leech tooth, giant grouper bone, giant kangaroo parchment, the color pale blue, war hammers, gauntlets, quivers, barrels, coins, ducks or the quacks, the words of the beige lutes, and the sound of the velvety flower. When possibly prefers to consume asparagus and soft wheat beer. He absolutely detests blood gnats. Asparagus is actually quite good. Um, and absolutely detests blood gnats. He has the ability to read emotions fairly well, away with words, and a feel for music. But he has a questionable spatial sense, poor focus, and poor analytical abilities. He dreams of crafting a masterwork someday. Good, I'm still alive. No, no, you're not, Hellfire. Makes your point followed. Thank you so much for following. Why does it say you're still alive? I thought I actively killed you. Thank you so much. I guess I didn't. Yeah, no, you're dead. I'm sorry about that. You must have slipped through the crack when I was killing everyone. There you go. You're dead now. Thank you. 
that took a bit i i made that on stream it could be improved a little bit but i did that over the course of two or three streams watching everyone get dehydrated and dying i think like it needs to be centered a little bit but kind of the problem is is i've updated i've updated all those programs so I can't get it to reload the old program. Like I know there's probably a way to get the programs to reassociate the old files. But right now, whenever I try to load up any old project of mine, it just seems to hang. Like it's not doing anything, but it's not giving me a this is frozen alert either. It just does nothing. So we're kind of at a point where I, I think if I wanted to fix the alert, you know, what little tweaks I want to do to it. Maybe a frame later here, make the bounce, you know, happen slightly sooner, so on and so forth. I think in order, I would have to redo it from scratch. Which kind of sucks. I'm not going to lie. So like a lot of the old videos too on the archive channel, uh, I can't fix them. If they've been uploaded to YouTube and they're an older video, like over a couple months older, I can't fix any of those videos now. Like the, the new project just will not load them. I think I still had the raws so I could redo it from scratch but I can't like tweak any of the files anymore because Photoshop and Premiere and all that good jazz just loads weird I don't understand oh god we're all gonna die no no look we have the brewmaster listening to poetry why are you listening to poetry Please, for the love of God, make moves. Why are you listening to fucking poetry? All right. Um, flash, flash, flash. All haulers are now brewers. I don't care who does it. Someone make booze. Oh, and while I'm here, kitchen, what are we allowed to cook? Don't cook anything that can be brewed or that I'm growing. You can cook the strawberry plants, I think. Strawberries, I believe, give me the seeds. Club helmets, don't cook those. Yeah, cook the things designed for cooking. Makes sense to me. Don't cook any seeds. Do not cook a drink. And you're allowed to cook the fish. That's kind of the point of the fish. We get the chef doing his thing. Someone making booze again, please? No, I think we'll live. I don't see that many, many down blue arrows anymore. I think we've gone through the worst of it. All right. From the line, it has to be a two and then a one. So, this is wrong, and that needs to be taken out. However, I can't do that yet. I need that ramp to be able to get up on that side. So, we're going to channel this down to fix the loop. All right, now that he has fixed that loop... Now I can get rid of this. Wait, no, no, I still cannot. So I need this quick opportunity to fix this wall. And then when I fix the wall, I can get rid of the other ramp. Yes. I'm too sad to fish. I'm going to go ahead and start engraving everyone's slabs, I guess. <laughs> in our ability to come together as a mountain home and pull through our lack of alcohol. I'm definitely not the, the worst streamer in the world. I don't know how I didn't notice everyone's getting thirsty. I think we're genuinely, genuinely good on the booze. No one appears to be thirsty right now. Downright Arrow is stressed. We have stressed dwarves, we know this, but I don't see anyone thirsty. So we're good. I can also just check this by looking at health, can I? Health, read. If I sort you by cast, that brings all the dwarves together. 
short by thirst. Only Lee Tast. Lee Tast is thirsty. The doctor who's ha- Oh, fuck. I forgot you were having a mood. You wanted metal. We have metal. Build, furnace, smelter. <laughs> oh, shit. We need dire builders. <laughs> Um, who does smelting furnace operating? Do I have any dire builders? No, I don't. Holy fuck. This guy is close. Dire builder. You have the skill in the very end. That clearly means you have all the rest of the skills. I need you to melt the gold now. I don't know how long that dude's been in the mood. I definitely 100% forgot about him. I need an architect shit. Once that is built, that ramp on the side will work again. All right, smelter was designed. It just needs a mason. Come on, smelter's up. Where's the gold ore? You were saying we don't have native gold. Or he's saying we don't have fuel. You're not gonna tell me, are you? We had native gold at the bottom of the tunnel. Did we not get native gold out of all the digging? All that non-digging we did in the gold? We have gold. Gold nuggets. So the issue must be a question of fuel. So now we need to wait on the wood burner to burn the charcoal. They're doing it now. Life sucks. That thing here is going I hate that That's thing. not him. That's just some other angry dwarf. We, 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 are, we are free to ignore that screaming. Forbidding, unforbidding. Pause. Forbid, unforbid. Q, smelter, native gold, go. Now we just have to hope that gold isn't dense or heavy and can be carried from a low point to a high point with an expeditious mode of travel. And also that our dwarves have the attention span to do it now. Oh, so fast. He is speed. <laughs> Go. Someone help him carry. Do a two man lift anything. Son of a bitch. So you're screwed because gold. Oh no, we'll be tons fine. Bad things are not going to happen. Boom, 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 boom. Come on. So here's what we're gonna do. We got the project, the water project, and maybe saving the doctor. Once these two things are over, we will we'll bring us, we will start to shut down procedures. Just a heads up, we have hit the time. It is midnight my time. It has been a pleasant eight hours. We have saved the doctor. All right. That was close. I think that I think that was a lot closer than many of us probably probably believe. Um we are needing more wood. Why are we not getting wood again? There are in fact trees. I know there's not many, but there are in fact trees. He is Speed. Clutch. Is there anyone else on a mood? I thought I saw someone else. No, there are other people. Like there was someone that was talking about like a possession or something because there was a ghost hanging around, but I got rid of the ghost. It wasn't a mood so much as it was a ghost that was bothering someone. 
Thank you for stream. Will you be hosting? I mean, I don't see why not. Do you have a suggestion for who I should host? I'm not, I'm not done done yet. This must be has been completed. Hooray! Echidna bone just rubbed my face in it. Latast Osagason, the doctor, has created Asastadar, an echidna bone amulet. She claims it as a family heirloom. Asastadar, the rapid mortality, an echidna bone amulet, oddly appropriate for a doctor to make. This is an echidna bone amulet worth 39,600 dwarf bucks. Real quick, the Virgin Scepter was worth 7,200, and the Echidna Bone Spear was worth 3,360. It has frozen Echidna blood on it. The Echidna Bone Amulet, the Rapid Mortality, is an Echidna Bone Amulet. All craft swordship is of the highest quality. It is decorated with sand pear wood. The object menaces with spikes of Echidna Bone and gold. That's actually not that bad of an artifact. It's expensive, it's rather simplistic. Really, the worth came from the fact that we use gold in it. And I'm pleased with this. <laughs> I'm impressed the fort. Look, just because randomly when I was unprepared, had no one in the military and had no defenses, just because I got attacked at the exact same time by the goblins and the undead necromancers and a joint assault of evil doesn't mean that we're just going to die. Who would die to such a weak assault as that? I have no clue how we lived. <laughs> Yeah, every artifact in this is just about those echidnas. Because for those of you who weren't here for the assault, the necromancer raised undead echidnas, which if you don't know, are currently glitched and immortal. You cannot kill them. So I, I should have added, added sheet. I'd use the attack command to kill the creature because there was no way to kill it. I would just be like, oh, it's really hard. I mean, no, they're indestructible. The, the way the game is set up, if they go into a ball, you can't actually strike them anymore. Because if they're in a ball, you're trying to hit an organ that no longer exists, but they're allowed to attack from said ball. So they're immortal until you die, <laughs> which is tons of fun. We lost a lot of dwarves to that joint assault and then the bleed out afterwards, a lot of dwarves. Now we want two floors, then the ramp. We have the ramp, we want two floors. I am going to now remove this ramp and do this wall as appropriate. We now have both of these set up together, but not fully powering. Once that is done, that can go. I'm trying to think of what I'm, what part of this I'm having power what? Do I join them together in one gigantic concerted power train? Probably, because if I leave them as two separate things and one of them has a power failure, the whole system ends up shutting down. So I might as well join them together just so I can get it to work. Have some redundancy built into a system and see if it can't be maintained. I don't have enough wood unless we got the floors in time. Oh yeah, we killed a bunch of trees. Bunch of dead trees. All right, so the Northwestern water retention. All right, fine. I guess we're going late tonight. For those of you watching on the YouTube archive when I upload it, <laughs> cliffhanger, see you guys next time.